these finalists have all shown they have the drive and determination to make it to the top ten. But after swimsuit and evening gown, ten becomes five. The selection committee has spoken, and I have the results right here. The first contestant to make it to the final five is... Philippines. Puerto Rico. Still alive in the competition is Philippines. Vietnam. Earning spot number three is Philippines. Oh, I love you. You're so beautiful. The most beautiful of them all. Locking down the fourth spot yeah, is all on the right side. No more. Next round, but there's only one spot now. left. Keeping her dream alive is Venezuela. This time, Philippines is the most beautiful. Miss Universe takes on a great Perfect. responsibility, Ooh. working as a global ambassador. She must be sharp, quick on her feet, and able to communicate with clarity and confidence. Contestants, yeah, get ready, name. because your answers will determine who makes it to the final three. Tonight's questions were written by some people who know you very, very well your fellow contestants. Now, once I read your no question, you will have 30 answer. seconds to deliver your answer. When your time is up, you will hear this sound. Puerto Rico, Vietnam, and Venezuela will be using an interpreter. Here uh, we go. Interpreter. Puerto Rico, please join me at center stage. Great. <laughs> well, here's your question. Hundreds of journalists across the world were jailed this year for writing stories that were critical of their governments. Why is freedom of the press important? Cientos de periodistas fueron encarcelados este año por haber hecho reportajes que fueron críticos de sus gobiernos. ¿Por qué usted piensa que es tan importante tener la libertad en la prensa? La prensa está para informarnos. Eh, no te debe mantener al tanto de las cosas importantes que están pasando en el mundo. The press is there to inform us. Their job is to give us the news about what's happening in the world right now. Creo que ellos deben tener total libertad de publicar la realidad de lo que está pasando. They should have total freedom to be able to report exactly what's happening. Sin olvidar nunca que deben ser sensibles y deben tener empatía. Porque hay muchas personas que están sufriendo por los problemas que hay en el mundo. Without forgetting that they have to have sympathy because there are a lot of people that are suffering different problems in the world. Caponca. Thank you, Puerto Rico. Vietnam, you're up. Are a problem. Thank you very much, Miss Universe. Well, here's your question. <laughs> the Me Too movement has sparked a global conversation. 
In response, some have said that the world has become too politically correct. Do you think the Me Too movement has gone too far? Không, chào Me Too đã làm thế giới nói chuyện về nhiều. Em có nghĩ là phòng trào Me Too có nói quá quá không? À, bản thân em không nói quá, bởi vì khi mà bảo vệ sức khỏe con người hay bảo vệ làm dụng tình dục, bảo vệ con người, bảo vệ phụ nữ, đó là một cái quyền rất lớn. She doesn't think that I don't think that it has gone too far. Protecting women and women's right is the right thing to do. Con người chúng ta cần được bảo vệ và trong cuộc sống của chúng ta cần được tự do và cần được bảo vệ. Cảm ơn. I need women need protection and rights. Thank you. Hakun Tha. Thank you, Vietnam. Kinapun Tha. Philippines, it's time. Here, uh, here's your question. Canada recently joined Uruguay as the second nation in the world to make marijuana legal. What is your opinion on the legalization of marijuana? I'm for it being used in a medical use, but not so for recreational use. Because I think if people were to argue what about alcohol and cigarettes, well, everything is good, but in moderation. Thank you. Thank you, so confident. Lovely. South Africa. Lovely right from head to toe. Philippines. I'm good, thank you. Uh, many countries across the world are experiencing an increase in immigration. Do you think countries should limit the number of refugees allowed across their borders? I think that every country should have their own rules and regulations. But for a thriving society and for all of us to stand together, we have to understand that we are all human. And we all are more alike than we are not. So we should be open to loving each other, accepting each other. Doesn't matter where we come from. Thank you, South Africa. Venezuela, get ready. English. How are you? I'm excited. Well, what would you say to someone who believes that pageants are archaic and against the feminist movement? ¿Qué le diría una persona que piensa que los cambios de belleza son anticuados y que van en contra del movimiento feminista? Hoy en día estamos en una era en la cual hemos avanzado muchísimo. Nowadays we live in an era in which we have advanced greatly. Los certámenes de belleza no son solo de belleza, también son de sensibilidad, de responsabilidad y de corazón. Beauty pageants are not just about beauty, they're about sensitivity and about having a heart. En ellas podemos mostrar que jóvenes como yo podemos lograr alcanzar todas las metas que nos propongamos en el mundo. In beauty pageants, we can show that women like me can achieve any dreams that we may have in the world. Thank you, Venezuela. Well, our five finalists, our five finalists have just answered some very difficult questions. And now, our selection committee must decide who's still in the running. When we come back, these women will face another elimination. And later, it's our final look with the performance by three-time Grammy winner, Neo. This is Miss University. So, work. I think you guys know that it took me three attempts to get there. I've always had this um, mantra that if you don't succeed the first time, you just have to keep on trying. And it almost felt like I was trying to climb this giant mountain, but I eventually got there. But of course, it's going to be difficult to make those new dreams come true if you're distracted because of a sore throat. Which is why I trust the Flam, because it prides itself with being the best it can be. It works hard to provide relief from sore throats from 60 seconds. I'm going to kill the one who did her eye so makeup. <laughs> Terrible. Doesn't sweat it out in the question round. Who do you guys think had the hardest question? I think South Africa had a really difficult question. Yeah, she did. Yeah, I think Venezuela too. You know, the question about the whole pageant idea is very topical. But she did a good job. Okay, so now it's time to.
to play the Miss Universe game. Okay, so we all wrote down our top three picks on a card during the commercial, and now let's each all of us reveal our final three. Lou, you go first. Okay, there we go. Puerto okay, Rico, Puerto Rico, South, South Africa, 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 and Venezuela. Venezuela. Carson? Can I say, first of all, that I was shocked that Thailand did not make this I top five. Know. Very shocked about that. Here are my top five. Oh, wait, that's the wrong card. card. Where my top five? Vietnam, South Africa, Puerto Rico. Vietnam, yeah, South Africa, North Philippines, Philippines, Venezuela. Okay, so we're going to see who made the cut. Back to you, Steve. We began this journey with 94 contestants, and now it's down to five. And in a moment, only three finalists will be left standing. Okay, get ready, because here are your final three. The first finalist with the chance to take the Miss Universe crown is Philippines! Woo! <laughs> Universe dream ends tonight. Our final contestant in the top three is Venezuela. Ladies and gentlemen, your three finalists. Congratulations. But you three finalists, you have to stay right there where you are because the next round begins right now. It's time for the final word. Now, each contestant will be asked the exact same question. While one contestant answers, the others will be wearing soundproof headphones. You've each got 45 seconds to respond. If you go over time, you will hear this sound. Venezuela will be using an interpreter. It's time for your final word. South Africa and Venezuela, headphones on. Please join me. Woo! <laughs> I missed this moment from last week. Congratulations. <laughs> I'm sorry, my bad. Okay, get ready. Here is the question. So pretty. What is the most important lesson you've learned in your life, and how would you apply it to your time as Miss Universe? I work a lot in the slums of Tondo, Manila, and the life there is very...